Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we got another dope video for you guys. So today what we have for you guys is the new Brawl Ball map that has just come out. So center field, it's a really interesting map. There isn't really one that's too much like it right now in Brawl Stars. But what from what I, from what I can see, it's super, super close range. You guys can see everything is very condensed and there's not a lot of range on this map. So what I think is going to be the best comp possible is going to be M's double tank. So to try and figure that out and figure out what the best comp in the game is, we're going to go into the games and we're going to run a few and we're going to see how this comp can do. But I bet you that this will be the meta comp here. So with that being said, let's hop into the games and let's see what we do. Okay, so here we go into our first game here. So we're going to be going up against a Nita, a Jesse, and a Daryl. So Nita would definitely be good here because Nita does counter tanks pretty well. Uh, so we're going to be able to get a couple shots there. Looks like this Nita's kind of just spinning. So I've spoken about that, about this in recent vids. Please don't just spin if you face us. So I guess this game could kind of go as a little bit of a warning. I don't know if it was throwing or what it was doing, but it definitely wasn't shooting at me. That's for sure. So, okay, it's trying. Never mind. I guess it was just saying hello to us. Gonna go for a play over there. Squash is gonna roll on. That's gonna be a really easy first win. So if you guys are spinning and saying hello, maybe I'll give a little spin, but definitely not when I'm recording a video. So that's gonna be our first dub. Really easy, kind of a free game. So let's hop into the second game and let's see what we can do. And let's see for real if this comp is the real deal. Okay, so here we go into our next game. So is this the, this? I think we're facing the exact same comp here. It's the exact same comp, different teams. So we're gonna move up the lane over here. Gonna try and take a few poking shots. Gonna move up the lane. Now we got a lot of HP and there's not really that much time for them to hit us. So we have a really good position here. Gonna get our super. And we're gonna get our stun. Oh, not a double kill. We end up getting one. Squashy's gonna throw that goal over there because why not? Uh, we're just gonna chill over here. Squashy has his pass. He's gonna pass it or at least try to pass it to us. I'm gonna end up going down. Ali's the ball. So Ali's the mid over here. Obviously we're gonna kind of use the lanes to make our way up. But Ali's the perfect mid here because Ems just does so much damage. And in a tank heavy map, obviously, Ems is pretty godly. So we are kind of getting destroyed here by this Jesse turret. So Ali should be able to take that out. She's going to be able to. Going to put that ball forward. Good roll over there by Squashy. Hopefully he's able to get the kill. He's not going to be able to there. Going to end up missing my super. I got to watch out for this Jesse stun. I'm going to go down, but Ali should be able to get that kill. Oh, she's not going to actually. Squashy intercepts the ball, but he's not going to be able to do anything with it. And it's looking like this is going to be a goal for the other team. It is going to. So one to nothing for the opposing team here. Kind of a scary start. So we're going to move up. Trying to avoid these Jesse shots, obviously. Squashy's going to try and make a play. He's going to hit a wall, unfortunately. So he's not going to be able to do anything there. Ooh. Ooh. Yikes. They might be able to get another goal here. Squashy should respawn in time, though. So we should be fine. Oh, but this bear is going to be lethal. Squash is going to get the roll off. I'm going to hit the super on only the bear. Going to try and hit this guy over here. Not able to. This is not looking very good at all. Trick shot. Oh, not able to score. Squash is going to put the ball away. But they're going to end up scoring here for sure. So it looks like they might have the better comp, actually. So I think we're going to switch over and try that one out. So let's switch over to the exact comp they have because we face a back-to-back -back game. So maybe that is a meta comp here. Let's switch over and let's see what we can do. Okay, so here we go into the next game over here. So we're trying out that new comp that we saw. Again, we don't know everything. That was, that was actually my first time playing on this map. So I'm just trying to figure things out. Uh, you know, it takes step by step patience. You actually do learn things from other teams, believe it or not. So we're going to be able to get our super over there. We're going to place that in an aggressive position. We're going to just put it up here. Hit that gene with the stun. And we should be able to do a good amount of damage here to them. So we did a fair amount. We almost have our super back. I think we just got it back actually. Oh, one more shot is needed to get it back. We're going to be able to get it back. We're going to hit this stun over here. And they're going to have nothing to do. We might go down. Okay, we're not going to go down. We're going to get our super back. And we're going to score our first goal. So good start over there. This is definitely a really good comp. So we're able to stun the M's, but I don't think that turret's going to do too much. Squashy's going to go for the roll. He's not going to be able to do anything, unfortunately. Good play by their M's. We're going to go down. Hopefully, Ali can kill that Rico. I don't think she's going to be able to. Rico also, I would assume, is pretty good here because of all the bounces and all the walls. Um, but this comp is definitely looking like the ideal comp here. Trying to get a couple more hits so we can get that turret. Gene does have pull, so we do have to watch out. Gonna move up the lane here. 
Got to watch out for that Rico super. Going to move up over here so we don't get too hurt by it. And we're going to get the ball. So we're going to go for a bounce shot over there. And that is going to be the third game. So pretty decent. This comp is looking really good, really dangerous. Those guys were 800 brawlers. So they are obviously good players. So with that being said, hop, let's hop into the fourth game. Let's stick with the same comp. I think this might be the meta comp on this map. So let's hop into it and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the fourth game over here. So it's going to be against a Shelly, a Leon, and a Rico. So interesting comp they have. Going to be able to get two taps really early on in the game. And this is already looking like a goal, actually. Only the Leon left. Squash is going to be able to get the kill. I think he's just going to pass that one forward to Ali. Ali with a little bit of a trick shot. And that is going to be our first goal. So things are actually looking pretty good over here. Going to shoot forward, trying to get our super. Oh, we're going to miss three shots. Kind of a yikes. Going to be able to get our super over there, though. Going to put this ball up. Should be able to stun at least the Leon. Going to be able to... Rico's going to by accident pass it to us. We're going to hit a little bit of a trick shot. That's going to be a really quick fourth game. So, so far, 3-1. and one, Not that bad, but undefeated with this comp. So, again, let's hop into the next game and let's see what we can do. Okay, so we've gotten some pretty fast MM here, which is pretty cool. So, we're going to hop into this fifth game over here. I'm just going to spray my shots forward. Tara went right side. Okay. Going to move up. Try and get three free shots over here. It looks like Tara's using her gadget right now. Squashy's moving forward onto that crow. Ali's going to shoot that ball forward. We're going to be able to get our turn. We're just going to chill in this bush over here. Squashy's going to be able to make a really good play. Oh, he's not going to be able to score though, unfortunately. No. Oh, yes. No. Oh, my God. That ball is lethal. BB could also be really good on this map. Oh, my God. I feel like a lot of brawlers can be really good on this map. So this is definitely going to be a little bit difficult to dissect the meta here. But I still do think we have the right comp, which is really cool because Jesse being a meta brawler is pretty rare nowadays. So it's pretty cool that there is a map that Jesse can be meta on. Going to get that stun. Going to be able to get that kill. And hopefully Ali's bear or just Ali can do enough. Going to put that ball in the net. Going to get another turret. And that's going to be one to nothing lead for us. One minute into the game. So we already have our turret. So we're going to walk up very aggressively and use our gadget. We're going to be able to stun two people. So we should be able to kill that crow. We are going to be able to. And Squash is going to put that ball right in the net. So we're going to go into one more game. Hopefully we're able to get the dub. Um... Pretty good comp, not gonna lie. There might be a better one, but I do think that this is the meta comp. So again, one last game. Let's see what we can do. Let's hop into it. Okay, so here we go into the next game over here. So our sixth and final game. So we're gonna try and get our super. Obviously, it's the most important thing is that we get our super. Obviously, the gadget does help a lot, but you don't really need it. It's definitely not necessary with this comp. Um, Mortises, please don't dash into a Daryl. Not gonna end well for you guys. So we're gonna get a little bit of an auto aim shot, but I kind of knew that one was gonna miss. Ali doing a little bit of pinching over there. We're going to try and help Squashy out in this scenario. So although we did help, we are going to go down. So is Squashy. So it's a two-on-one right now. Ali's just going to push the ball forward and kind of save a little bit of time. Uh, good play by her. I'm going to throw my turret out. Use the stun. And now both brawlers are going to be stunned. So although it didn't do too much damage, um, the turret, we still got a really good value stun out of it. And we're probably going to get our super back very shortly. So I'm looking for the pinch here with Ali. Unfortunately, I don't think she sees it. But we are able to get our super either way. Just going to throw that rate on the spike. We're going to get the stun. We're going to try and keep it alive, but we're not going to be able to. But we are in a really good position here. So Squash is going to pass the ball to Ali. Mortis making some good plays with his gadget, but Squash just has too much HP. So Squashy is going to put that ball in the net. So one to nothing. Again, a little bit over a minute into this one. Going to throw our turret forward. Going to use the stun. Going to be able to get that kill over there. Our turret's looking pretty weak at this point. Just trying to keep it alive. Good plays by that Sandy to kind of keep us in the middle, but it's not going to be able to do too much. So we have our turret again. Squash is going to go for a play. Let's see if we can get a trick shot or something. Oh, good pass, I guess. I guess that trick shot turns into a pass, and we're able to get the dub, and that's going to be it. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed our kind of like reaction to this new map over here. It is definitely a really good map. I do like it, although it is a little bit similar to others. It's completely different in some ways. It's kind of similar when it comes to like the proximity and how close you have to be to the other brawlers in order to do damage. You can't really play like a Piper or a Brock here, but I do like the uniqueness of, of it. So anyways, that's going to be it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. But for me, that's going to be it. I will see you guys again tomorrow. Peace.